Are you looking for a website builder that's more tailored to your specific needs than Wix? Even though Wix is an incredible platform with some amazing features, there are a ton of great alternatives out there that you can choose from. In today's video, we'll be going over those alternatives and figuring out exactly which of them is right for you. We'll be talking about their features, their price points, and more importantly, how you can use them to build an amazing looking website. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear idea of which of these builders is right for you and your website building journey. Make sure to watch this video all the way through to the very end so you get access to all the exclusive deals and discounts that we have available for you guys. Each of these website builders we'll be talking about today will have a link down in the description below so you guys can get started with them. Other than that though, let's get right into our first Wix alternative. The very first Wix alternative we'll be talking about today is Hostinger. Hostinger is an incredibly easy to use website builder that has a ton of functionality. It also prides itself on having some of the best web hosting and domain options available on the internet. If you're thinking about utilizing Hostinger and building a website, one of the most key features that you'll want to pay attention to is their AI website builder. This is a website building tool that basically allows you to build a website completely from scratch using nothing but AI, which is a super impressive feat given the fact that AI has become more and more prevalent in today's day and age. When you're using their website builder, you simply just type in whatever you want to create and the website builder will do everything for you. It'll build out your entire website for you, giving you a great place to start actually editing that website and putting in your own flair and your own twist. Hostinger also has incredibly awesome customer support, boasting a 24-7 response time for any questions that you might have. Hostinger boasts lightning fast loading times as well as super dependable uptime, meaning that anybody who goes to your website will always have super fast load times and your website will always be accessible to them. Now when it comes to pricing, Hostinger has some of the most flexible options when it comes to the overall tiers that they offer. As you can see right here on their pricing page, they have a premium option, a most popular option, and their cloud startup option. For the premium option, we're looking at about two dollars and 99 cents a month which is going to save you about 75 percent for their business option we're looking at about three dollars and 99 cents a month which is going to save you about 71 percent and for their cloud startup plan we're looking at about seven dollars and 99 cents a month with about 68 percent that you're going to save there all of these tiers have their own benefits and as each tier goes up in complexity there are more tiers made available to you at each level like for instance on the premium level we get about 100 websites 100 gigabytes of ssd storage and of course a free domain and for the most popular plan, the business plan, we get something very similar with about 100 websites, 200 gigabytes of NVMe storage, and even a free domain as well. Plus, you'll get access to a few other features that you don't get access to inside of the basic plan. Now, that free domain that you get is probably one of the main reasons I would suggest hosting. The reason being is because having a free domain for your website is an incredibly useful tool. If you guys want to get started with hosting and get that free domain in the process, make sure you use the link down in the description of this video. That's how you're going to get access to that free domain plus a bunch of savings. Also, not to mention too, make sure you guys use our code at checkout to save even more money on your purchase. All you simply have to do is scroll down to where it says have a coupon code, click that, and then enter in the coupon code my first website, all capitals, no spaces, and then hit the apply button. Once you've hit that apply button, you'll save even more money on the original plan that you choose. Now that we've talked a bit about hosting, let's get into our next alternative, which is SiteGround. Now, SiteGround is pretty easy to use. They have a ton of great intuitive features when it comes to building a website. More specifically, Specifically, this website builder is directly integrated with WooCommerce. If you guys are unfamiliar, WooCommerce is basically an e-commerce platform that allows you to import products directly onto your website. This can be super helpful if you're somebody who wants to build an e-commerce store for a fraction of the price that the other e-commerce store builders allow you to do so. Because of this, SiteGround is really one of the only website builders out of these alternatives that has this feature. Plus, not to mention that Wix already has an e-commerce feature, so this basically is direct competitor. As you can see, they have over 4.8 out of 5 stars, and that's based on over 17,000 plus reviews on SiteGround, giving it a super solid review score by users. SiteGround also makes it super easy for you to start using email marketing. If you want to create a landing page or some kind of lead magnet, SiteGround has you covered. You can create any of these business assets and start collecting emails pretty much on the fly, which will of course allow you to build a list that you can start marketing to immediately. Also, one of the big benefits here is that SiteGround does offer a free domain when you initially sign up with them, which is of course super helpful. Now, one of the main things that you want to look at with SiteGround is is their web hosting and also their WordPress hosting. WordPress websites are incredibly popular in today's day and age, and there's something that has become pretty much commonplace in the professional web design space. Because of this, having a service like SiteGround that gives you direct access to WordPress hosting is incredibly useful, especially if you're trying to build professional websites on a service that is used pretty much as the industry standard. Also, if you take a look at their web hosting plans, they are very affordable. As you can see, for their startup plan, we're looking at about $2.99 a month, which is going to save you about 
83%. And for the most recommended plan, we're looking at about $4.99 a month with their Grow Big plan. Each of these plans have their own benefits, but for the Grow Big plan, you have unlimited websites, 20 gigabytes of web space, and over 100,000 visits monthly. And it's even easier to actually get started with SiteGround in the first place. Make sure to use the link down in the description to get started, and that's how you're gonna get access to that free domain that I talked about. Once you click that link, you'll simply choose the plan, enter in your domain, and then hit the review and complete option to actually get started with SiteGround. That's pretty much everything you need to know about SiteGround. Now let's get into our next alternative, which is a super popular and very professional looking website builder. That of course is none other than Squarespace. Squarespace has a ton of functionality and it has a lot of the features that the other website builders have that we talked about. Drag and drop editing, domain hosting, and even e-commerce functionality are all features that Squarespace allows you to utilize. The big benefit of Squarespace is the fact that they just have so many different templates that you can choose from. If you're somebody who's just getting started with web design, most people recommend getting started with Squarespace. Squarespace is super easy and intuitive to use and their templates make everything that much easier to edit and make it all your own. All we have to do to get started with Squarespace is hit the link down in the description. First thing you want to do is click the link down in the description and hit the get started button once you guys get to this page. Once you guys are inside of here, all you'll have to do is simply tell Squarespace a little bit of information about your website or you can simply opt to skip all of this information as well. Once you've entered an information or skipped, you'll be at this page where you can either build out your website with an AI tool or browse the templates that they have available. For the sake of this video, we'll just go ahead and browse their templates. Any of these templates will do depending on the type of website that you're trying to build, so we'll just go with this one. Once we've selected this one, we can then select our design, pick a color, and then hit start with this design. Now we just simply have to create a quick account here, enter in my first name, my last name, my email address, and then create a short password. Once we've done all of that, it should take a short time for everything to get set up properly, and then we should be fully inside of our website ready to edit. And real quick, so that way you guys get an extra 10% off of your original plan. All you have to do is head over to the plans, pick which plan you want to go with. For this case, we'll do the most popular plan, their business plan. Head over here and pick which one of these we want. We want to save some money, so we'll go with the annual option, confirm our selection, enter in our street address, our city, the state, country, postal code, and then we'll hit the save and continue button. Once we've done all of that, we'll then enter in our credit card details and then hit save and continue. Once you've guys finished all of that, just make sure to enter in the code my first website, all capitals, no spaces at checkout, and you'll get that extra 10% off. Now that's pretty much everything you need to know about Squarespace. Let's get into the last two Wix alternatives. The first of these Wix alternatives is Webflow. If you're someone who just doesn't know how to write code effectively, Webflow is an awesome alternative. The reason being is that Webflow prides itself on its no code features. These no code features are super helpful if you're somebody who doesn't know how to code in the first place. Or if you're trying to code or custom code something specifically on your website, Webflow already has pre-made templates that you can insert whatever idea it is that you have. Because of this, Webflow makes some incredible looking websites all without having any prior coding knowledge. They also have a ton of beautiful looking templates and have pretty much all the other features that we talked about in the previous website builders. If you guys want to get started with Webflow, it's completely free to do so. You just have to use the link down in the description. Webflow also is super catered towards website design agencies. If you're somebody who finds yourself designing a ton of websites for different companies and that's what your business model is built off of, Webflow pretty much has you covered. And then of course, last but not least, one of the other website builders that we highly recommend recommend you check out is WP Engine. Once again, WP Engine has pretty much all of the features that we talked about in the previous website builders. Drag and drop editing, website hosting, domain hosting, and of course, very intuitive website building tools. One of the big benefits about WP Engine is just how simplified their pricing structure is. As you can see, we have a host of different options to choose from, and this is pretty much geared towards any and all different budgets. With the light plan, we're looking at about $13 a month. For the startup plan, we're looking at about $20 a month. And for the professional plan, we're looking at about $40 a month. Month. Any of these larger plans are meant more for larger corporations or already established businesses, so we don't really need to cover those. And one of the best parts about that pricing structure is that all of these plans include these great features. Some of these features include things like 24-7 WordPress support, threat blocking, WordPress security, managed WP and PHP updates, flexible site copy tools, annual SOC2 audits, and ISO 2700 certifications, and a host of other features that you're going to find super useful. Overall though, guys, those are going to be the main alternatives that you'll want to consider if you're looking at something other than Wix. Let me know down in the comments below which of these alternatives you're thinking about using or let me know if you've already used them. I'd love to know your guys' thoughts and overall opinions down in the comments below. Also, if you want to get started with any of the alternatives that we mentioned today, make sure to use the link down in the description of this video. That's how you're going to get access to the best discounts and deals possible, plus some of those free domains that we talked about in the beginning of the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe so you never miss any of our future videos. Other than that though, that's all I have for for you guys today. I'll see you guys in a future video.